I'm here with Brighton bass band Foria. They've been singing and playing for us their song once again. Jeb, Truen, Tim, thanks so much for being with us. You're not from here. Why did you guys decide to move? Um, well, we, uh, we all grew up in the countryside together playing music and obviously there's no one to play music to in the countryside. So we wanted to move to a city, preferably near London. And I don't think we can all hack the pace of London. So we moved to Brighton because it's got a much more sort of relaxed vibe, but it's still got the music scene. Jeb, the, the visuals that you use are yep. obviously very important to the whole performance. How did that come about? Well, uh, it, was, it was quite a slow development, just starting with playing with projecting visuals over us when we do our shows. And then we got an opportunity to do it in, uh, in a, a dome, so it's going to be visuals three, 360 degrees. Uh, so it's going to be a really immersive experience. It's a, it's a huge place, the screens are going to be six metres high. So Tim, what do you think about this whole notion of a cultural Olympiad? Uh, I think it's a great thing uh, to be doing and to be involved in for us. Um, the Olympics obviously is about different countries, different nations coming together, uh, sharing experiences, you know, everything like that. And if we can put a bit of British culture out there as well, we think it's really cool. But uh, we just think it's good and we benefit from it, so it's all good. Okay, let's hear a bit more of Once Again.